The purpose of this video is to show you how to navigate through Skies as a student. Right now I'm on the Student tab. If you are a student in multiple courses, all of your courses will be listed under the Student tab. If you are a student in only one course, you won't have as many courses listed here. You will just have your one course you are enrolled in. To go into your course, just click My Class. Once you're in your class, you'll have this menu panel to the left. By clicking on the titles, you will either access your lesson, meaning you'll see all these cards that your teacher created for you to start working on, or you will see, once you click on the title, it acts as a folder. If you don't see any cards, if you click on the title, you will have to go and click on the sublessons within this folder. Now I see cards. If you ever want to close the menu, you can click on the three horizontal lines that we call the sandwich button. By clicking it, it closes the menu. To open it again, you just click the sandwich button one more time. For my middle school and high school students, or my students with multiple courses, you can click My Class at the very top and you can toggle between your other courses. That way, you don't have to go all the way back out using the menu to go into your other classes. Let's say your teacher wants you to go back and look at other lesson titles. Right now I'm in grades K through 1. For instance, let's say your teacher wants you to go to number 1, Introductions. Well, I don't see that on this view. By clicking the link, it'll take me back to different views. I clicked Try a Lesson, so now I'm back to this view, and now I can see Introductions. Let's say I'm in this view and I click Sky Smart Start. Yes. Now I can see all these different lesson titles and I can go into each of them again by clicking in the title. Now that we see the skies cards that we're going to be working on, we can close the menu by clicking the sandwich button. When you want to scroll through all the cards, you can take your two fingers if you are on a laptop and you can put them on the trackpad um, and then you can drag to the left or the right to move the screen. You can also take this scroll bar down here and with your mouse you can go ahead and click on it and you can move it over. There's also um, one that's vertical so you can take it and drag it down. Now that we know how to scroll through the cards, I'm going to show you how to make your screen bigger or smaller. So there's these magnifying glasses up here that you can click on to make it bigger by pressing the plus sign with the magnifying glass or the minus sign magnifying glass to make it smaller. So whatever view you'd like, you can set it with these magnifying glasses. If you would like to make the card bigger, Instead of using the magnifying glasses up here, you can double click on the card and it will go into something called presentation view. When you're ready to go on to the next card, you can just hover your mouse at the top and you'll see that this uh, menu appears. It's blue and you can go ahead and click bigger on the top right hand corner to make the card bigger. Scroll down to see all the details. You can make it smaller. You can use the arrows to toggle through each uh, slide of this lesson. And if you don't like this view, you can always click cancel. If you wanted to use your keyboard arrows, you can also do that in order to toggle through each one of the cards of this lesson. And then you can click on escape when you want to get out of that view on your keyboard. Whenever you'd like to log out, all you have to do is go to the top right hand corner, click on your username, and then log out. And then you're done.